What's new, Pussycat? Whoa, whoa, whoa. G'day, welcome to episode 261 of Trent 365. Today is Sunday the 19th of August. Had to think there for a minute. Packing the bags again, heading off for another trip, which is nice for a change. Uh, off to Bali for a couple of days, a couple of days of budget meetings, just trying to get some idea on what we're going to be doing next year. Um, <clears throat> but before I do, I just want to talk to this idea about herding cats. You've probably heard the expression, it's impossible to herd cats. And really what that talks about, I guess, is the idea that it's the, the challenge of managing the unmanageable or organizing the disorganized. And I think it's particularly relevant to anyone in a big organization or maybe one that has people spread out over large areas. And I heard a quote the other day from a guy called Frank Blake. Now, Frank is the former CEO of the Home Depot, which anyone in the US would know is a big uh, home hardware chain in the US, home hardware retail store chain. And what Frank said, and it wasn't his quote, he attributed it to one of his board members, but he basically said it might be hard to herd cats, but you can always move their food. And what I love about that is that it speaks to the motivation of the individuals rather than necessarily the mission or the task. Because the, the first response might be to try and get everyone to agree on the same path, everybody to get them on board with your mission and your vision and where you want to take the company. But what this talks about is don't worry so much about that because that could be a pretty hard task, particularly if you've got a history or the employees have got a history with the company and you want to change the direction. Um, but if you just move the incentives and you structure those incentives such that they reward the activities that you want. So they reward the activities that give you the outcomes that push you towards your mission. They don't need to know necessarily where that is, although that's great and they, it's great that they accept it. But if they don't, as long as your incentives, i.e. the food in this case, as long as the incentives reward the actions that get you where you need to go, that's probably what you really need to do to get the results. So it's an interesting perspective on the challenge of motivating employees and the, the, the challenge of, I guess, turning an organization around and heading them in a different direction. All righty, that's it for today. Thanks for tuning in. I will be back again tomorrow. See ya. Pussycat, pussycat, you're so thrilling and I'm so...